Welcome everybody. We got another episode of Be a GM commentary with the Philadelphia Flyers, a team that I don't know if we're really ready to win a cup, but I'll try my best to get them at least as far as possible. Um, so yeah, well, let's just get into the calendar and see if we have any tough games coming up and we can actually make some serious trades. So also a couple of comments telling me what to do, but I think we're still doing pretty good here. If anything spirals out of control, we always have the trade deadline to do something. All right, so we'll go up to the 28th against the Rangers, and then we'll we'll ch we'll evaluate this team and see if we're ready for a playoff push. I, I think we should be. I mean, honestly, we really should be. But you never know. So in the meantime, I'm gonna go check and see the comments just to double check if there's anything really that I missed. Well, yeah, there's a loss of Phoenix. That's not good at all. All right. Yeah, thinking about trading LeCavier would be a good idea. Yep, I'm probably going to trade LeCavier. I think it makes the most sense. It's just old piece of nonsense on this team. So, yeah, we can get a good young player for him too. So, yeah, we're probably going to trade LeCavier. I think it's a very good... Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do it now, honestly. There's no uh, time of... Yeah, we're losing games. So we need, we need Vinny out of here. He's not helping this team at all. Trade and improve. Who could we get? That's the question. Wow, there we go. I was glitching out for a second. I was worried. All right, so let's see how much he's worth. Vinny, where is he? I'm worth a nice chunk. I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. all right, it's a lot of cap that we're dumping off, which is very good, obviously. Um, we're going to get, obviously, a center in return because what well, wouldn't make any sense then. You know, um, I don't know. This is tough. Should we go for like a Morin Hansel type player and be very young? I respect him. Yeah, we're getting Morin Hansel on this team. I I think let's see let's see if they accept it. I doubt it, but yeah, reject it. All right, we'll sauce a couple picks there and see if maybe they'll accept it with a couple picks, not first round picks, but a couple second round thing. Well, oh wow, what a long, what a large amount of trade value. Well, let's just see the second round if that'll go through. And it did. All right, so we got Morin Hansel on this team. He's got three years still on his contract, so hopefully that'll help out this team. I think it will, um, especially in the long run, too. He's a young player. What we need, obviously, over here in Philly, we're all made of old, washed-up players. Um, I mean, I know a couple teams like that, the Devils, but actually, before, I think we should check the defense. Maybe we could improve on that a little bit, too. I don't know, though. Let me just see. Let me see defensemen. Oh, I didn't mean to go to right-wingers. All right, here we go, defensemen. There's more in. Where's Goss's bear? I don't understand. He's not even on the team. That's weird. All right. Um, well, let's see overall-wise for this team, if we're, like, good defensively. All right. So we got Coburn, 85, 85. Well, we don't really have, like, that true number one, though. That's the only thing. I think we'll be all right, though, for the season at least. We'll, t we'll talk about that in the offseason. Trading for a number one defenseman, or at least drafting a good one. Because clearly, we don't have the right pieces here in Philly. All right, so we're going to have to stimulate up to the first. Hopefully, the, the, the trade actually helps. I'm hoping it does. Let's see. Let's see the first game. Probably we'll win like 9 nothing. so it looks like we did Unreal in that trade, but I don't know. We'll see if Morin Hansel, I think he's on the third line, I think, or probably, right? And a 5-3 loss to New York. Unbelievable. We need to come together, though. We cannot miss the playoffs, or this will be a failure as a GM for the first year we lost to. We're losing to teams we can't be losing to. The Islanders and the Capitals is unacceptable. we got Eastern Conference teams. we got to win. Look at this, the Canadians now. Come on. Is there probably a good team? Yeah, they are. Oh. There we go, okay. We gotta beat Columbus, though. They're in our division. Come on, come on. Come on. We've lost so many overtime games. The only reason we're probably actually in the the, the uh, race. Nine overtime losses. Unreal. And there's a big win against Columbus. Hopefully it wasn't an overtime. That would not be good. I mean, I'm just glad we got the win, though. Um, at Buffalo, hopefully. That should be simple. And we lose in a shootout. Unreal. Ten overtime or shootout losses. That's crazy. Um, come on, come on. Columbus is unreal. They're like first in the division probably. And we won 6-2. That's, that's a light em up. That, that's a light em up game right there. Six goals at home. Um, Buffalo, we should be able to beat them. 
And we we do, alright. Alright, I'm, I'm liking it a little bit. We're getting into a little bit of a streak here, I'm noticing. We've won uh, four out of the, out of our last five, which is pretty good. Um, make it six. Five out of the last six. Make it s fucking six out of the last seven. I'm, I'm going to keep doing that. Uh, Yannick Weber, no thanks. <laughs> Yannick Weber wouldn't have been the greatest idea for this organization. He would have been a minor league player, but, um... Wow, how's Carolina doing good? That's kind of weird. And we lose 5-1. I guess they really are doing good. <laughs> Alright, Toronto. I wonder how they're doing. Basically the same as the Flyers. Us, I guess. And a nice loss. If we miss the playoffs, this is a failure. Come on, we gotta beat the Rangers at least. Is it all right? We're home. All right, we can't. Oh my God! You're like number one. I don't know what happened. I think we lost. Yeah. No. Oh, we did thirty-one. All right, good. That was a huge win, actually. Okay, so let's see where we are. Stat Central. Oh my, we're fourth in the Metro. That's not good. <laughs> That's not good at all. All right. Let's see. Where do we go? Um, Hub, Stat Central. All right. This could be a little. I'm a little worried. Drew has only sixty-three points. Not enough. So, Metropolitan Division, we are fourth, and that's not good. Eastern Conference, all right, let's see. How do we match up? We're uh, fourth in the Eastern Conference, so I guess we're not too bad, I guess. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll make it, I think. We'll be fine. I think we should get a defenseman. It might be a little bit unrealistic. I'm going to trade a first-round pick. I mean, it might be a little unrealistic, but... I want to make the playoffs this year. Let's put it like that. There's no reason to miss the playoffs. So we're saucing around our first round pick. Whoever wants it is going to get it. Let's see what happens. Here's 2016. 2016. All right, all right. I'm back. Little audio issues there, but... San Jose, Pittsburgh. What would be a good defenseman to get? Any suggestions, my good man? Defenseman. Any team? We just need a defenseman that's solid. All right, let's go to Dallas. This is words of wisdom from my brother. Are you looking for a star? Well, yeah, I'm looking for like an average 85 defenseman. I'm looking for like 88. Plus. You know, oh, Danby's not bad. What is it? 86. That's not bad, no. Um, I just I feel like I want like a number it's not one defenseman. First round pit, first like Daly's not, no. Let's just see if Duncan Keith would go through. Stop it. League approved. Oh, I thought maybe for a second. We can pull it through, though. We can do it. If we give away all these picks, watch. You're going to mortgage the future to get one defenseman. We, we're not trading prospects, that's all I'm saying. He's like 35. Duncan Keith's not 35. We're good. We're going to get this. Duncan Keith, well, how old is he? I don't know. Probably young. He'll be like 20. I don't want to get an old defenseman, obviously, because, I mean, we're, we're really uh, giving away the future here, obviously. But I really want to be good this year, and I kind of want to win the Cup in the, like almost every year, honestly, because we are an unreal team in reality. So we should be winning championships, obviously, with Drew at least. I mean, Drew's got to get at least one Cup with us. That, that's, just, that's just how it should be. Um, Subban, no, he's not worth it. How much probably Weber's worth a lot. Probably, like, he's the best defenseman, I think, in the game, so... Um, well, make it unrealistic. Let's go for it. Ryan McDonough? Ah, oh, that'd have been nice. We need, we need someone like Ryan McDonough. We'll, we'll, we're gonna get him, actually. We're gonna get him. Let's do this. We're gonna get Ryan McDonough. Here we go. Okay, no. We can do this. We don't trade with a rival. We do trade with a rival. This is gonna work. We don't do business. Come on, we need to get Ryan McDonough, alright? We don't, this is, this is... There's no time to joke around anymore. We need to make the playoffs. We're, we're really not like a safe bet for the playoffs. All right, let's do this. 
We're in. We got Ryan McDonough. All right. Okay. People don't want to see you do stupid things. I mean. Well, they they. You know, I want to win the cup this first year, so I want to do what I can to win the cup. All right. Where is edit lines? I don't even. This, this game's so like messed up. You don't even know where to go for edit lines. Here we go. Edit lines. All right, offense. All right. So that should get us to the playoffs. Where's what's his face? Yeah, there's handle. Okay. Starting labs defense. All right, let's just best lines it for now. Where do I go for that? Oh, there you go. Best lines. All right. So let's go to defense, and that looks a lot better now. Okay. Yep, looks very good. Okay, all right, so let's just simulate to the rest of the season, then we'll end the video there, and then basically that's it. That'll uh, wrap up this first regular season here. Calendar. Obviously, we don't need to make any trades at the deadline, so we can just simulate past that, of course. And we'll just go up to April, let's see, the 12th, and we'll just hope we make the playoffs, because I'm not making any other trades. There's no reason we shouldn't make the playoffs. We really have a, a, a pretty good team, in my opinion. Um, if we make the playoffs, if you guys have any suggestions for some of the lines I should put together, let me know, because obviously I want to, I don't even have the mic on, see, look, I'm fucking losing all this, look at that, because I actually like, keep turning it off with you, come on, hurry up, I don't understand, I, I have it on the mic. Dude, I don't care. So, uh, whatever happens, happens, we're making the playoffs or we're not, I'm simply Yeah, we're going to... All right. Yeah, that's a loss. That's fine. But we've been winning a lot of games. We're, we're definitely in the playoffs. Unless we really collapse against these teams. All right, so yeah, it looks like we're going to just finish this season very strong here, and we're going to just finish off this season very good, honestly. That's what it looks like so far. Um, yeah, we're going to win. We're going to make the playoffs. All right, so my vicious trades at the deadline really did work in the end. Um, yeah, let's just finish this season as strong as possible.
Alright, so last game against Otto here, and we lost 3-1, but I think we, we did make the playoffs, I'm pretty sure. Let me just send it up to the next day, just in case. I'd be pretty mad if we did lose. Alright, we're playing Tampa. We are obviously not the number one seed, so we are at Tampa Bay. So, let me know, guys, if, you sh if I should change up the lines or anything. Let me show you guys the lines. Let me just show you guys the lines, just so you guys know exactly how everything's looking here. So, if anything seems a little weird to you. I could uh, fix it, obviously. So here are the forwards, obviously. There you go. McDonough, Delzado, McDonald, and uh, Coburn, Streit, and Luke Shen. And then, of course, obviously, we're not going to be starting Ray Emery in the postseason. All right? So that's just about it. Um, I guess we'll show the uh, playoff tree if they have one. I don't even know if in this game they have one. It's pretty bad if they don't. Um... Do they have, uh, yeah, there's a playoff tree. Okay, so that's the playoffs this year. The Flyers are playing the Lightning, that's us. The Canadians are playing the uh, Red Wings. Rangers and Blue Jackets, Devils, Penguins. Blues, Flames, Blues, Avalanche. And I guess that's all i got to show you guys, right? Let me see. Um, well, yeah, I guess I'll show you the whole NHL who made the playoffs this year. Well, you just saw it, yeah. I, mean, I guess I'll just show you how many points and everything everybody had. All right, so there you go. So that's about it. So thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next video. Please like, obviously, too. Definitely would appreciate it.